scrambled egg. Start off in a cold pan. And the secret here is the working. When you go on and off the heat, eggs overcook instantly. Now, crack the eggs. The secret of any good scrambled egg is in stopping the eggs from overcooking. We never whisk our eggs before we cook them. It turns the whole thing grainy. Six beautiful whole eggs. We go onto the stove. From there, I take a couple of knobs of butter. On with the heat, spatula, and we start stirring. And the most important part here now is breaking up those eggs. As you can see, I'm using the plastic scraper. So I'm on the heat now. I've got no seasoning in there. I'm starting to generate the heat. You can see the eggs starting to cook. I'm 60 seconds on, I come off now. I clean down the side of my pan, I whisk it back in, and there is a secret. Making sure that you're folding everything from that pan, cleaning the sides, and so I've got maximum yield on the eggs. I'm off for 30 seconds, I go back on. I turn the gas down and we whisk. Look at the eggs, how quick that's cooked. They come off, I fold them in. Now to stop them from overcooking, a little touch of creme fraiche, fold that in. Now is the moment I start to season my eggs. Creme fraiche cools my scrambled eggs down, slightly seasoned. The gas is off. I've still got that heat inside my pan, but the eggs are light and fluffy and seasoned. Look at the color of those yolks. I like a light sort of onion flavor. And all I do here is just put some nice, beautiful chopped chives running through. Incredible. Sprinkle the chives on top, fold them in, and look, they just sit there nicely. There's no water. And there we have a beautiful, stunning, amazing scrambled egg.